Yo, what is going on YouTube? Today's video, I want to bring some attention to three little bugs that I feel like didn't necessarily make the cut as the most important bugs going on right now in Modern Warfare 2. Now these bugs I don't feel are game stopping or make the game unplayable in any kind of way, but they're just little changes or things that I just kind of feel like I would love to see fixed by the time Warzone and of DMZ release on November 16th. Uh, so without further ado, let's get into it. The first change I would like to see takes place in the gunsmith. Whenever I'm partied up and someone is leading that party, if they wanna make changes to say the playlist right when we start up a queue or they wanna back out and uh, take care of their build, it takes me immediately out of the gunsmith and back into the menu screen. Uh, definitely not one of those sh like sto show stopping problems, but definitely something that I find just somewhat annoying that I would like to see changed. Nothing major. I don't think it really does anything bad to the game. Definitely not a deal breaker, but something I would definitely love to see change later on down the road. The next issue that I wanted to get into was dolphin diving. For whatever reason, and I'm not sure if there's a setting that adjusts this or that fixes this issue, but whenever I'm sprinting, tactical running or anything like that, and I dolphin dive, my character doesn't stay prone. And from what my friends have told me is that whenever they tactical run or sprint and dolphin dive, their character stays prone on the ground if they have that setting set to where it's not on hold, if it's on toggle or if it's on go to, which I've tried both. And for whatever reason, whenever I do dolphin dive, my character does not stay prone on the ground when I need him to. And that kind of throws off a lot of the gunfights that I've lost because of it and even in some cases where it's like i have a dedicated button for going prone but instead of going directly to prone my character will crouch and then i have to tap it again for the character to lay down on the ground now i'm not sure if this is a bug or if this is a design change or if i'm just missing something but if you have any type of like idea on what's going on here if it is a bug of some sort comment down below and let me know what i can possibly do to fix this if there even is a fix for it now the last honorable mention bug that i have experienced and it's happened multiple times has been voice server disabled now I'm not sure if anyone else has seen this, but I will sometimes get a message at the top right hand corner of my screen telling me that the voice servers has been turned off or I've been kicked out of it or it's not working. And once that happens, I cannot hear my teammates. My teammates cannot hear me. And with the potential release of Discord chat coming to PlayStation in March, having to wait that long, me and my friends who are all on PlayStation use the in-game voice chat. But with this server issue kind of going on, it does kind of make it impossible when we're trying to communicate or even just shoot the shit and just talk and we just get interrupted because there's a message that kicks us out of the voice chat server. I'm not sure if anyone else has been having this. I kind of feel like this island actually is a big issue if you're not using discord or anything like that so i definitely feel like this could be at the forefront along with the getting kicked out of the game servers and things like that so there it is guys i didn't want to make this one too long my overall thoughts and opinion of the game despite all the bugs has been fun i found myself playing this game for hours and hours and hours over the weekend i think that when the game works it it does work of course we still have the dmz to come out and warzone 2 to come out on november 16th and i'm hoping that these bugs that are kicking people out of the servers and kicking people out of the game and the crashes that are happening do get fixed before that happens because i'm not sure how well launch will be for those modes coming out later on in two weeks if you liked the video, you already know what to do. Smash that thumbs up button. Consider subscribing to the channel for more videos. I'm going to be definitely doing some more content on Modern Warfare 2. And hopefully in the future, as these issues get resolved, it'll be on a more positive note. And I'll catch you guys in the shadows.